Hello, welcome. Episode 19 of the tutorial on ratio and proportion. And uh, this, uh, we are taking sharing of a quantity by a given ratio. So, Mr. Mensa has three children, Kwame, AC, and Yao, which he leaves 160 cattle to share. So, Kwame got one fourth of the cattle as the share. Then AC and Yao share the remainder in the ratio three is to two. So, first question: How many cattle did AC receive? Then two. How many more cattle did Yao receive than Kwame? Meaning, in all, we need to know the share of each person before we can be able to find the difference between Yao and Kwame. So let's begin. Don't forget the previous episode, we are to identify the ratios and each share. So in this case, we are identifying Kwame, AC, and what? Yao. But before then, we can see that Kwame's share is not in a ratio, but is a fraction of the total. So we are going to start with Kwame's share or total number of cattle, which already is what? 160. Then Kwame is going to be one fourth of whatever they are sharing. So he's taking one fourth of 160, and we know 4 will go into 16, that will be 4 times, times 10 will be 40, meaning we will be having 40 cattle. So if Kwame take 40 cattle out of 160 cattle, what will be the remaining cattle for the two people to share? So we can see that the remainder of the cattle is going to be 160 as the total minus 40 for Kwame, and that leaves us 120 cattle. So this 120 cattle is what is going to be shared between AC and Yao in this ratio. So we can say that the ratio is going to be AC is to Yao, which is going to be equals to 3 is to 2. 3 part for AC, 2 part for uh, Yao. So let's find the total ratio. So the total ratio is going to be 3 plus 2, which is going to be 5. Meaning these cattle will be shared in 5 parts. Whereby yeah, AC will be taking 3 parts of that share, then Yao will take 2 parts of that. So we can find AC's share. as ratio corresponding to AC, which is 3, divided by the total ratio times what they are to share, 120. I believe if this 5 will go into this, 1 times, that's 2 times, remember that 2. Then we have having 20, so we have 24. Then 24 will also multiply 3. So this, go here 1, go here 24, 3 times 20 will be 60, so we have 72, right? 72 cattle for AC. At this point, we can subtract the 72 from 120 for the remaining for Yao. Or we can also find Yao share as ratio corresponding to Yao, which is 2 out of 5 times the 120 Cattles. Already we know 5 is going into this place 24 times, 2 times 20, that is 40, plus uh, 8, that will give us 48 cattles. So in the first part, which we are asked to find that of AC, I think that is what we are done here. So we know the amount of cattle that AC received. In the bit of finding Yao, that means we are starting with the second question. How many more cattle did Yao receive than AC? So we need to know how many cattle Yao is receiving. 
And I'm sure at this point, if you look at the difference between Yao and Kwame, it will be eight turtles. So what do we do? We are going to have 48 minus 40. That gives us what? Eight. So now that we know the difference between the 48 and 40 as eight, we can say that how many more? So Yao receive eight more cattles. So that will be the final answer for the second question. I believe you follow the concept. Thanks for watching. Share, like, and comment. Bye-bye.